November 9th, 2016, the day after the U.S. presidential election. The result, Donald J. Trump wins and is president-elect. So what kind of an America can we expect after Inauguration Day on January 20, 2017? Let's start with the economy and President Trump's motto to make America great again. Trump would simplify the tax system for everyone and reduce the number of income tax brackets from 7 to 3. He would impose a maximum tax rate of 15% for every business and end the death tax. On regulation, he would likely scrap many of the ones from the Obama administration. President Trump would also end the moratorium on coal mining permits, opening up new mines across the country. Speaking of energy, President Trump will end former President Obama's executive action on the Paris Climate Agreement. He would lift restrictions on American energy production and allow oil and gas producers to start drilling on the outer continental shelf. On trade, he would renegotiate NAFTA and label China a currency manipulator. President Trump also says he will end China's export subsidies to bring back millions of jobs. On terrorism, it is still unclear whether President Trump would enforce his blanket ban on all Muslims entering the United States. However, we know there would be a process of extreme vetting of Muslims and other people from terror states. That would most likely begin immediately. On ISIS, President Trump is waiting for his generals to come up with a plan to fight ISIS in the first 30 days. He has not ruled out the use of nuclear weapons either. It is unclear at this stage, too, what will happen to alliances like NATO and also with South Korea and Japan. And finally, President Trump's key issue, illegal immigration. He would ask Congress for the funds to start building a giant wall between the United States and Mexico. On day one, President Trump will initiate a set of measures designed to make Mexico pay for the wall. These include a rule barring anyone from sending money overseas without first providing proof of legal residency and cancelling visas. On the illegal immigrants already in the United States, Trump says there will be no amnesty and has also proposed a possible deportation task force to round up more than 11 million undocumented immigrants. Donald J. Trump, the 45th President of the United States. For CNBC, I'm Phil Hahn.